October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month to help show support for all those who have survived it in the past and give a voice to those suffering right now. Today, Harbor House of Central Florida, a group and hotline for anyone dealing with domestic violence, is bringing a national model to Orange County, and that's known to reduce deaths from domestic violence. News 6's Mark Clayman shows us how it works. Well, today marks the beginning of Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Advocates say it's an issue that requires attention throughout the entire year. Community leaders coming together here at the Orange County Sheriff's Office and talking about resources available to survivors. Safety is the foundation of everything that we do. Harbor House CEO Michelle Spurzel is announcing the planning process for a family justice center in Orange County. By co-locating services, family justice centers create a one-stop shop for survivors and their families. The study tour launching in January comes with the goal of removing barriers for domestic violence survivors. Help from law enforcement, judicial, advocates and therapists would come to a central location. This model is proven to reduce homicides. It's proven to improve victim safety and enhance collaboration amongst all of our partners. Today's announcement also comes as a new law strengthens penalties for misuses of tracking devices. Making it a third degree felony to use such devices to monitor others or their property without their consent. The clerk of court is also rolling out a program today to help survivors. That new tool is what is called a hope card. It's a free wallet sized card that survivors can use to verify with law enforcement that they are covered by a protective court order. All of this builds on a continued goal of awareness, encouraging those experiencing abuse to speak out. The more we talk about abuse, the more we name it, it reduces someone's fear, it reduces someone's shame, and it reduces their barriers to coming forward. In Orlando, Mark Lehman, Getting Results, News 6.